fresh be in the name of the Lord and insisted good morning good afternoon and good evening wherever the time is where you're watching or listening to these clips I bring forth once again word of life word of encouragement and word of wisdom unto you living from the book of life according to Proverbs chapter 22 verse 29 Proverbs 22 29 scripture say do you see a man who is diligent in his business say he will stand before great men he will a diligent man in his business in the career will stand before great men I speak to somebody that spirit of listening that spirit of I cannot do it that spirit of mediocrity I'm good enough this is okay for me i rebuke it in your life in your family in your career in your businesses in the name of jesus the spirit that is looking for somebody to come and be everything for you i come again that spirit in your life in jesus name look at what happened to saul the first king over the nature of his according to first Samuel chapter 9 from verse 10 to 18 bible say and saul's father she got lost and his father said unto him saul Go with my servant and go and look for my own sheep that got missing. Without knowing that God was setting him up even for his own encounter. I pray for you. Where you think you have become a non-entity. Where you think nothing that is good that is coming your way. Where you think you have been retarded. Where you think you have been abandoned. The position you are, you think you are better off. I pray as to become diligent in that place where you are. In that offices where you are. In that career where you are. In that business that you are doing. As you become diligent, the Lord will reward you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I pray for events that will connect you to your prophet because Saul needed a prophet. He didn't know that he was going to pursue his own career and his own life, but he was going on an errand for his father. I don't know the errand that people have pushed you to. I don't know the one you are voluntarily doing now. I don't know where you find yourself. I don't know in that office where you think your services is no more appreciated. I say God will set you up for promotion. God will set you up for a word of knowledge from a prophet that will translate into word distribution into your life in the name of Jesus. I pray for you, brother and Be diligent. Whatever you find yourself doing, do it as unto the Lord. You will receive a worthy report, a good report, a good testimony. You will receive a word of prophecy from, from your prophet that will take you and connect you to those that are meant to be in your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Saul was diligent in looking for the lordship of his father. And he had an encounter with Samuel and Samuel anointed him over as a king. You will be anointed over your brethren, over your nation. You will be anointed. You will be single out. You will be spotted for good things. Even this month of May, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, go and fulfill this. Tell it in his presence. Until I come here well again, God bless you.